What's up everybody, my name is Flamble, and today, as y'all can see, I am back in the old world that I did the first one or two Minecraft episodes in. I'm back in this world, but before this video actually starts, I need y'all, I need y'all, I need your help. I need some questions answered by you guys. Now, number one, first and foremost, should we keep this world, or should I just get rid of it? Because we haven't touched this world in a long time. It's not really nothing I want to continue with. But I will if y'all think we can save it in some sort of way. And if y'all think we can, then hey, give me some ideas in the comments. I've been posting Minecraft like for the past two Mondays, I think. Maybe. The past two Mondays, if not... I don't know. I've posted Minecraft on two Mondays so far. I'm planning on doing Minecraft Mondays. Honestly, but I don't want to tie myself down to just, you know, I like it random, but I, if it can get me more structured than I would love to, because I'm thinking Minecraft on Monday, a random series on, a random video on Wednesday, and like a series I'm doing on Friday. So just tell me what you guys think about that little setup that I just hit the rocks to demonstrate with. Just tell me what you think of that, if it's a good one, if it's bad, whatever. And just let me know what y'all guys think about the world. You know, all that good stuff. All that good stuff. And while y'all are telling me that, please go like this video if you haven't already, right? And follow me on my Twitter and my Instagram. Those links will be in the description. They're always in the description. So if you're not looking down there in the description, I don't know what you're doing. You better go look down there. And let's just get into the rest of this video. I love you guys. There's 180 you motherfuckers, so let's keep going with that. Uh, and we're gonna go into the video. Alright, see y'all later. Hey, look, look, the sun's the sun's going down to signify the end of this intro. Alright. Alright, bye. What's up everybody? I'm in the new world now where I did the most recent Minecraft video. If you guys haven't seen that video already, please go watch it because it was very hilarious and I suggest that y'all check it out. Can't close this gate looking like this. I just wanted to give y'all a rundown of the new world since there wasn't much to be seen in the newest video. So I'm just going to give y'all a rundown of what there is actually and just stop looking like that. I'm going to give y'all a rundown of what there is and show you guys what's up around the world and give y'all a new layout first and foremost i know i'm in creative right now there aren't gonna be there's no achievements in this world but i mainly have creative on just in case we have any cool ideas like these little these little light posts that are ne that's next to me right now or stuff like that or if we want to upgrade our house in any sort of way like really fast but like usually normally we do all of this in creative not creative like in survival, survival. fucking survival yeah that's it Right? Yeah, survival is what I meant. Got it. But other than that, other than that, right? Mm -hmm. I keep. There we go. Other than that, we got. Here's my farm, my little animal farm. That wolf over there took out all my chickens. I sent her to go take out. That's a out... fox! What? That's a fox! What did I say? Wolf! Ugh! The fox took out all the chickens. I sent her to go do that, and she got rid of all of them. That's beautiful. My best friend kidnapped one of the traitor's llamas. Two of the traitor's llamas, actually. Braylon uh, did that. Uh, whatever. Look, we got... She did. Pig cage. My best friend recently helped me obtain rainbow sheeps. So you'll see them change yeah, colors all the time. So that's great. I gave my uh, best friend... Some rabbits, but apparently they've gotten out of his house and into my pen somehow. We got cows, they we got chickens. Over the fences, the little I even got my mule back here. All right, we got potatoes, melons, hay, what have you. Where did that fox just go? Here it is. What the? The hell are you stand? Don't even. You know what? Here, I'm just gonna show you all the respective houses, right? I'm not going to show you the inside of Scott Storm's house right here. I'm not going to show you Braylon's house, because y'all don't need to know about that just yet. But, I can show you the inside hey, of my house. house fires, this is y'all YouTube channel. Don't you show my shit yet. I was going to show them the... Fine. Why is your door open? You probably left it open. 
Alright, fine. I guess I can only show y'all my house. Damn, it's my best. No, 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 don't show. I said don't show my house. Yeah, I never said you shouldn't show them. Fine, I guess I'll show my house first. Okay. The hell? So what house? What this is? This was the actual beginning of this whole house, right? This was literally it for the longest time until my friend Storm came around. They're the one with the blue house. They came in and I asked them. I asked them to help me upgrade my house and they did a beautiful job. And I've just been upgrading it every now and again with what I see fit. Down, like here, this is the main area to go in where I have all my chest and things, my, you know, furnaces, crafting tables, things like that. This right here, oh, shit. This right here, right? This right here is my secret way down into the caves. So then, you can just go that way, or you can go this other way to get in the caves. There's some extra beds down here if need be. And then you come through this painting, and there's a whole room of paintings, first off. There's also... Someone really needs to cover this up. I never noticed how this looks before. I need to fix this in some sort of way. But regardless... I got arm. That's right here before knees. I need to figure out what to do with this room. Honestly, if y'all want, if y'all have any ideas on what I could do with this house, please give me some ideas. Me and my bestie have already come up with some things, but there are big areas like right here, that room, this room, this hallway. Don't back touch here. that cookbook. Shut up. Hold up. This is my room. Don't touch that cookbook. This is my room, one of my favorite house rooms in my house. It looks beautiful. It's all red. My Next favorite to the, color. Next to the right. You can you got a good view of Braylon's house from here. If I can see through here, you can barely see through here. But you can kind of see my bestie's hooker hotel. You can see the top of my tower. My tower is like halfway blocking Storm's house, but you can still see. I don't it. know why we call it the hooker hotel, but I guess it's just whatever. You agree on the name, whatever. Look. I didn't agree shit. I agree on Jake shit. I don't know why we started calling it the Hooker Hotel, but the name stuck because I like the name. Yeah, exactly. It's not meant for hookers. It's just a free place to stay that the residents can get freaky deaky in if they want to. That's what that is. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Now, coming through here, you got an amazing view of the Hooker Hotel. You also got a little railway over there that I'm going to show you guys in a second, maybe. You walk through here... It's not even a hooker hotel, because there's not even that many rooms in it, now that I think about it. You walk through here, this... and then there's this room. I don't know what to there's put in here. Area. And then there's this water elevator, right? You go up here, and in this first room, it should be the guest room. I had a whole bunch of villagers in here at one point. But then my bestie reminded me that there could be pillagers that run up into our, into this place, into our place of living. So I'm not really here for that. So I just killed them all, right? I killed them all. But their cats stayed, and I don't mind them staying. They're hung. They don't really do much. Here's the kitchen. We got a working fridge. We got the dining room table. We got the chairs, the kitty chair over there for some reason. We got the stove. We got the sinks. Cabinets and yeah, do like not that. touch that cookbook. Oh yeah, this cookbook, this cookbook right here has all Vincent's grandma's secret recipes. We don't, we don't look in here, all right? He won't let me. You know, I'm probably gonna look in here anyway. Yeah, right. right. But we don't look in there. No, no, don't look in there while you're on camera, at least. <laughs> and here, there's a lot of things in there that should not be read. Here, here's my something. grandmother has some irrelevant methods. Here's something that I did last time I was in this world, and my bestie hasn't had the chance to see this yet, but I can't wait until he does. I ended up converting the top of the tower from a simple room into a wonderful rooftop little balcony area. Beautiful sight lines, view of the mountain up there, things like that. Beautiful, just beautiful. Also, there's a chimney right there. Forgot to even say that. The chimney right there, puffing out, puff, puff, smoke, doing things, you know. Things like that. Now, Bestie, are you cool with them seeing the um 
the Hooker Hotel or no? Go ahead. Also? I don't know why, I don't know how much of a hotel it could possibly be considering the fact that there's only like, let's see, the kitchen area, my bro just transformed that place into a hotel. My TV room, plus there's also the upstairs area, that is also another lounge area that we call the lounge area. Because it's got a couch and a low seat. But, Asia, you can just watch the drama go on through from outside that from outside that main window that couch is in front of as long as you don't mind the statues that are in front of that place. Like I said, that's pretty much everything except for one last thing that I want to show you guys. One more thing I want to show you guys is this beautiful, beautiful pond area. It's absolutely wonderful. My friend Braylon came in on her first day and made us this. I'm not sure what gave her this idea, but I'm very happy that she did it for us. It's a great little aesthetic right next to the Hooker Hotel. It's just, it's great. I highly thank her for that, which is why I gave her something as a gift. Hopefully, hopefully she enjoys it next time she comes in here into the world. But I'm not gonna show it in this video because she's probably gonna end up watching it and spoiling it. So yeah. Now, besides all that guys, ooh, I almost walked into the pond. Besides all that, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. I wanted it to be quick and kind of fast. I just wanted y'all to get a good layout of what is to come in future videos, the area and stuff. I'm probably gonna go exploring sometimes by myself or with my friends, so just keep an eye out for that. Any future Minecraft videos and make sure, like I said before, show your support, like and subscribe and Tell me, tell me what could be added, what could be done better, what you want to see us do, anything like that. And besides that, have a nice Monday, guys. Bye.